Hello, everybody, and welcome to the Spot Ghost Morning Show, broadcasting from the home of the comic book men. Jane Sound Bob Secret Stash. My name is Ming Chen. Sitting across from me. My name's Michael Zapsick. How are you doing, folks? Sitting in my left, Mr. Marco Eddie Van Halen. Our very special Costello. guest. Good morning, good morning. Mark Costello, the good time fellow. The good time fella. In the house. In the house. How are you? You you seem you're brother. fine. You're, yeah, I, now, uh, I just pounded. You were smiling. I just pounded that, that coffee super fast because uh, I wanted to get all pumped up, and uh, now I got to go pee. So I'll be back in a few minutes. No, uh, you yeah. you'll <laughs> piss you in a cup you, and like it. You totally chugged that rook I did, coffee. I did, man. It's you totally a, chugged that rook coffee. I have it on video here. <laughs> I'm gonna have to post a still from that, <laughs> or I might just do the whole video. It, it's not that long. I think I did it in about what 15 seconds. You did. You chugged a. That is a bigger. That is a bigger than usual. I think that's the old, that's the biggest size they have. Yeah. So they have a regular and that bigger than regular. Aside bigger than regular from is like, the box o coffee. Delicious. Bigger than regular is like 24 ounces. Yeah. yeah. So I literally chugged that in five seconds. Best Impressive. coffee in Red Bank. Thank you, man. Rook coffee, everybody. Thank you. Rook coffee. I, 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 Rook. I, Coffee. Rook coffee. So Black good coffee. that you have to chug it. It's awesome. My best coffee in Red Bank. I know. Now I know you just burned your esophagus oh, to no, peace no, no, to no. hell. He doesn't care. We'll put the pictures up. Maybe they'll start advertising on our show. That would be fun. Not, I doubt it. Not likely. <laughs> we do enough for we do enough of it for them for free. Yeah, they don't have to, right? I don't They're like fuck it. Let's just let's just don't yeah. give them anything. Yeah. <laughs> just, yeah, why are we giving yeah, why are they giving true. them stuff? Yeah. Business one oh one. We why would we have to pay for it when they're already advertising? Yes. Talking about why product. why buy the cow when the milk is free? <laughs> yeah, Don't do it. Yeah, we we um we operate on the opposite. Um you know how like uh, um like Brad Pitt, Leonardo right. DiCaprio, they got all these all this free shit. Yeah, they don't need free shit. They can buy shit. <laughs> right. Yeah, right. we're the opposite. Yeah, we well, don't get we don't get free shit. We buy more than we need. It's like Gene Simmons. He's right. like, what are you giving me? Yeah. For the what what what's in it for me? It's in it for me. And how hey. can I uh, copyright the bag with the dollar sign on it? Yes, and he oh, did. Oh, no, he, he didn't do that. He tried though. He right? tried. Yes, and you can't do that. I heard he oh, he copyrighted OJ for orange juice. Yes, OJ. he did. He did that. He, oh, I believe, or he tried oh, to. I mean, he imagine? tried to anyway. And OJ Simpson's in jail, going motherfucker. How long have we all been saying a glass of OJ? And then he's just one day, he's like, you know what? I wonder. You that's owe me a dollar. His mind Smart. works where it's just like, I wonder if this is. He's walking around all day saying, I wonder if this is trademarked. I wonder if this is copyrighted. I mean, that's. It's a brilliant. It's a brilliant guy. A rich guy. That's what that is. Right. Not the finest human being on the face of the planet. Uh, Not some, Bono. No. Well, <laughs> I have a lot of personal experience with him, too. And he's uh, he's always been a little. Uh, uh, he comes off as being better than the rest. You actually. I'm not the only person who has personal. No, I we, forgot. We do not have. Yes, you are not the only yeah. person. But that's yeah. for a little bit later that's on. later, sure. Yes. Yep. So anyway, uh, a couple things. Okay. Uh, Ming, you know yes. I've been binge watching. Uh, I binge yes. watch stuff. Yes. What um, have you been watching, Mike? Something that uh, <laughs> most people know about okay. and is absolutely brilliant. Okay. Uh, I think more people should know about. Okay. Key and, uh, Key and Peel. Yes. On Key Comedy Central, Peele. Key and Peel. Been watching nonstop. Yes. Key and Peel. And fantastic. These guys are the funniest duo I've seen in. Oh my For God, I can't tell you. since they're at least as funny, if not funnier, okay. than Mr. Show with Bob and David. That's that's and crazy I thought talk. that was genius. That's crazy talk. Um, <laughs> I didn't think there was a uh, a stinker in the lot of right. Mr. Show. Okay. Nothing there, and this is even better. I, I, that's crazy talk. Um, for the kids out there who haven't seen it, uh, give me a quick synopsis of Key and Peele. Key and Peele are, uh, they, they are self-proclaimed uh, biracial gentlemen. Okay. Uh, white moms, black, and, and for some reason, that's that's important enough that they said that in the very first episode. Sure, really? Yeah. Okay. So they said that uh, they, you know, uh, very cutting edge humor. Okay. Um. Uh, and they they do it's a sketch comedy show. Okay. Uh and they have little bumpers where they they play off each other and in, in front of a live studio audience and right. then they go to their their um their sketches. And it's brilliant in its simplicity and it's brilliant in just so many ways. Sketch comedy, a half hour sketch comedy show? Uh program? yes. Well, 22 minutes okay. with the and it's free if you've got Amazon Prime. Just Is it? Check okay. on well, yeah, who just doesn't have Amazon Prime. 
Uh, Mark, Amazon. how you doing? You got Amazon Prime? I uh, do not have Amazon. You don't need Prime, Amazon Prime. You're like, man, can you get this for me? Yeah, man. <laughs> have it here in man, days. can you burn this stuff for me? Yes. Well, I don't even have a television, but we'll get into that. Yeah, minute. well, it's it's I suck. You don't I didn't need watch to. You have an iPad. Bowl. That's true. You, That's true. you, you listen to the. I listen to the Super Bowl. You don't need a Super Bowl. You can go to a, a bar and watch Super Bowl. You uh, can go to somebody could, else's house and watch Super Bowl. Yeah, yeah. You could go to Foley and have a Super Bowl. Yeah, I could. Mike actually knows what I did during the Super Bowl, and I was actually listening. And this is going to sound like a load of bullshit. I was actually listening. To podcast podcasts. Were you during the Super Bowl? Hand to God. Lame. Man. Hand Which to God. smodcast podcast were you listening to? I listened to, to uh, the Tesdy that you were on, okay. that you sat in on. Yes, thank and you. And then I listened to um, an Edumacation. Okay, good. And, and then I listened to, uh, I'd gone back and critiqued uh, one of the ones we had done a while ago. Right. You're a well. big sports fan. Why? Um... I had it on in the background. Oh, I you had, did? Yeah, I had it on. I, I like to sometimes listen to football on radio, and I also like to listen to hockey on radio. Uh, I like hockey and radio. Yeah. Um, I like. To, I have a vivid imagination, so I can imagine. I can. You know what's really that. awesome yeah. is that he had Norman Rockwell over to paint him, <laughs> and the family around the the Victrola. the Victrola while he was uh, the Super Bowl was Hold on. Hold on. So you didn't actually see that horrible play? No, no. It's you better, heard it. I heard it, and no. And then I it's went not out. The and s- I, I know. Well, he I didn't did. even hear. Or actually, you did hear the super uh, the the circus catch. Right. But you didn't. You had no context. Oh no! I I did then load it up on the computer to oh, see okay. what it looked. Like. But you yeah. still had no. You're like, wait a minute. What are they talking about? This is. This sounds really weird. Oh yeah, that I had no. I had no. Oh, he's reference fumbled. He's now for the fight rubble. at the end of the game. Yeah, I had no nothing. reference. And meanwhile, Walt is texting me constantly, and he's right. saying, "Did you see that?" Did you say? And Mike was texting me too. And you know, did you see this? And I, I could hear it. So in my mind's eye, as yes. you were just saying, I had the picture of it. Okay. And I've seen enough fucking football in my life. You know, yeah, but I, that was no. That, there was some weird shit. I know those, there was those last right. uh, those last two plays. Yeah, yeah. You, you were you may never see those again. I know. Well, when I did finally look at them on the uh, intranet, yes. I, I did uh, see what I had missed. But again, you know what? Life goes on, man. Oh, it, it does. does. Well, I mean, I know you had no dog in the fight. Or no, I did not. I did not. No, none still. of us had a pony in the race. I was race. rooting for the Pats. I was rooting for the Pats. Though. Were you? Yeah, because Why? you know what? Because the Giants kicked the shit out of them in two Super Bowls. So I don't. Oh, okay. I don't really have a hate for them like everybody else. Does, I see. You know? Yeah. So. You I know. see. But, I uh, see. Mike, did you watch the Super Bowl? I did. Wow. What possessed you to watch sports? My son asked me if we could watch the Super Bowl. And really? I said, Fuck yeah. Wow. So we watch. We can watch as many football. I told him. I said, Mitch, if you want to watch football, uh-huh. you're more than welcome right. to. I said, we have the. We have a, a nice. No big... son in my. No son <laughs> yeah. in this family is gonna. No, no gonna son say. in this family is not gonna not be gay. Well, yeah, I was gonna say, <laughs> in, in spite of you not being a real man and liking sports, you're allowing yeah. your boys to grow up and be. Well, real I told them. I nice. said, if you want to watch a- any. Yeah, it's good that you allow your kids to grow up straight. Yeah, like yourself. Oh, of course. <laughs> so my wife and I went out uh, looking for scotches. Um, <laughs> no, it was uh, he said, can we watch the Super Bowl? I'm like, absolutely. Hmm. And I have nothing against sports. I have no, again. No dog in the race. Mm-hmm. So uh, I don't feel passionately about the Giants or the sure. Jets. Sure. I've seen that. I've, I've gone to football games. Okay. I have been to, I, you know, I, I used to go to um, Middletown South football games, even though CBA didn't have a football team. Right. I would go to, uh, I'd go places and do things. Good place to meet chicks for high school right. football yeah, games. Yeah, South right? Cheerleaders. Sure. I, I yeah, heard stories about them. Uh, yeah, I dated South Cheerleaders. So, so you know, whatever. That's right. where you heard the story. Exactly. That's right. <laughs> You're right. All right, Mike Zafsik. Um, so, but yeah, we watched it. We had a, a fun time. Was had by all, and the blacklist was on afterwards. Oh, okay, they which did. was fantastic. Nice. It was it was a little, you know. I'm like, ah, oh, the Vince Lombardi trope. Who fucking cares? Get to the blacklist. Uh, I, they, I need um, me some red. That's weird. So they didn't try to premiere some new horrible new show afterwards. No, they they uh, gave you the. Um, the blacklist. Okay. And I'm like, that's my man James. Right. After the Super Bowl, watch Handle with Care. <laughs> yeah, I right. John Handle and watch, yeah, exactly. <laughs> watch uh watch Too Many Cooks. Yeah, too many cooks. Wow. Uh so yeah, it was So you um, saw that. Okay. So I saw, saw it all. I, I had you a, saw yeah. the horrible play. I saw the horrible play. I, and even I said, Holy shit, why'd they do that? Yeah. I know. Even Mike Sapsick, who like oh my probably God. has not watched a football game voluntarily all year. Till this one, uh, true, very yeah. true, yeah. And I you. actually have the text on the phone where it's, he did say, "Holy yeah. shit!" It was something about what a play or yeah. yeah. Ho- no, I said, "Holy shit!" Wow. Question mark exclamation. It did. It threw mark. me for a loop getting it from him, man. It really did. Wow. I was like, Whoa. Even Mike Zapsic knew they should have handed it off to Beast Mode. <laughs> oh, that's what you do. You <laughs> exactly. You put it behind the wheel of the steamroller. Yeah. 
the, the yes. most feared running back in the of league. Of course. Why would you not? Even if the whole opposition, they, they knew it was going to go to him, they wouldn't have stopped him. That's my feeling. Mm. That's the guy's honest truth. And I, I have to say, our pal Walt was uh, absolutely over uh, outraged at yeah. the play calling. My oh, phone, yeah. Lori was sitting next to me, and my my uh, my ringer on my uh, text was going, bing, yeah. bing, bing, Crazy, bing. yeah. Faster than I could answer them. Wow. And, and Walt was going, how could you not give it to him? Right. What about that play? What do you think? And, wow. like, and here's the really weird thing. I was texting Walt as well. Yes. And so I was, uh, it was like a, a triangle. Was a yes. Threesome. Information. Oops. Yeah, devil's, devil's triangle right there. You know, he would have been even more mad if uh, if I would have accepted the bet oh. that they laid out in front of ah. me. On the Tesla bet. We'll re- recap. Yeah. No, I was, uh, you know, they were like, who are you going to win? I was like, I don't want to see the Patriots win, but I think, you know, Tom Brady's good quarterback. I think the Patriots are going to win. I think they were the better team. Mm. And um, immediately, what was like, bet you 100 bucks. Yeah, well, Seahawks win. I thought it was Q. Q actually and, well, took it yeah, first. Yeah. Um, yeah, so Q it would have been 100 each. Yes. <laughs> yeah. so and you would have been, been showered with money. I would. Well, two two bills. <laughs> two bills. That's, you, can make it, you can make a rain with $200 you, bills. Oh, you definitely can. But you know what? Just like ten Mur- dances, Murphy's so. Law, man, if you would have yeah. taken the bet, what would have happened? Right? I think I think the Seahawks would have handed it to Marshawn Lynch and they would have scored. They I just, you know, is that a little egotistical? Sure. Well, you think Carroll is going, wait a minute, Ming Chen didn't bet on it? Ah, fuck it. Uh, pass. Yeah. Pass. Go ahead. Start. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, pass. I don't we'll, care. We'll, we'll, uh, you know, yeah, either it's it a passing in, game. That's what it is. Or gets intercepted. It's probably going to get intercepted, so let's do it to screw him. Uh, highest rated television show ever, I heard? Ever? Uh, I don't think it was the highest rating. It was the highest rated Super Bowl Oh, ever. was that it? Okay. Not the highest rated. It uh, beat I mean, MASH? It did not beat MASH. Nothing, Look how nothing mad. will ever. Look how oh, mad. you motherfucker. Look how <laughs> mad Mike is. It's like, how dare you? I thought MASH did get beat by like Seinfeld, though, or something, didn't it? Maybe, I don't know. Yeah, I know. I still You'd have carry, to check. Ming's going to check. I carried a torch for MASH. Oh, fuck it's like. Fuck MASH. Fuck yeah. Sh- oh, I'm not fuck MASH. Fuck Seinfeld. Well, I mean, you know, it's uh, it seems like every year, though, the Super Bowl just be- outdoes itself. It's yeah. Like, well, this year well that's what it is. Uh, and how about that game. Lenny Kravitz, huh? He was on stage for what, like a minute and a half? Good on you. He was like second in uh, second in command of that. Oh, man. I love the dancing sharks. I'm, that's just me. Did you happen to notice, and I, I'm sure you guys picked up on this, that every year you could bet on how long the uh, national anthem is. Like, you could bet in Vegas. Oh, really? There's an over and under. It's like a minute and How a long? Really? Yeah, you you could, could bet? Oh, it's been good. Yes, I swear. Oh, dude, you can bet on everything. But you can bet on the Bleeding length of Murphy? it. And this goes back years <laughs> because you can, it's it usually like, if it takes a minute and 20 seconds. It's like an over and under. Yes. So you can bet under. Or, mm. And when this girl started singing this year, I knew that everybody who had bet over a yeah. minute and ten, they must have been so psyched. Oh, yeah. Because between the first like opening line yes. and the second, it seemed like it was like a thirty. It was, it was already a minute and a half. <laughs> yeah. So you're dragged you're it good. out. I guarantee. But bleeding goes Murphy style. Yeah, that's yeah. right. Listen, I got uh, one other thing. Yeah. Constantine. Yes. Constantine. Yes. John Constantine. Yes. Watch the comic it. book guy. Watch it. The, or... You know, you need to watch it. Okay. We got. We got to get people to watch or go save Constantine. Is it not doing it's, well? It hasn't been. Uh, it is perhaps the best adapted. Really? Uh, yeah. Okay. They actually lift entire- even better than the Keanu Reeves uh, adaptation. Gee, you think? I'm just kidding. I'm, I'm, yeah, you know I'm just what? asking. <laughs> oh my God. The um, yeah the the um, the Keanu Reeves. I uh, you know what? I've never actually asked for anybody to go out and kill Keanu Reeves for me. Okay. But that movie. Nah, nah. I won't. Kidding! I would never ask. Uh, Keanu Reeves is uh, great for what Keanu Reeves does, right? But he shouldn't have done Constantine at all. Okay, was it his fault? His agent, you know, someone presented his agent. And, no, there's and a lot. That, there's I a lot blame, of stuff. I don't blame him. There's a lot of stuff that's his fault. Okay, I blame um, him. But uh, Matt uh, Matt Ryan is the gentleman who is Constantine. Okay, he is phenomenal. He he actually gets the flavor of Constantine. Okay, that uh, mix between Sting and um, like a con man. That's, okay. That's basically it. And uh, mystical con man. And uh, if you haven't watched it, give it a shot. I'm begging you. No, I'm not begging. Uh, if You're doing yourself a disservice if you don't watch Constantine. Dig it. I'll and they didn't give shot. me any money for that either. Another free ad. Another free away. fucking Jesus ad. Jesus Christ, man. And NBC is like, Jeez, hey, man. these guys are jackasses. And let, yeah. Let's put something else sure. on that we'll cancel in a second. I just want to backtrack one second because we were talking about the uh, betting. I just pulled it up here, and they actually suspended betting for oh. the National Anthem this year because Why? an insider tipped off 
a few people on how long the rehearsal was. Oh, and right. everybody bet. There were so many people that bet the over because oh. she was rehearsing at 122.5 seconds. That's so the national right. anthem was oh, coming in. Oh, that right? sucks, man. I know, I know. But it, it took multiple max bets over, and they figured something was up. So just that's a, that's that's to close right. out that so that part of the, the show, if you will. No, because you went back, you fucking dug up the corpse, right? Dragged it out into the light of day, and let everyone we'll smell the stench. Just leave the blanket yeah, on the body. Is that what you're you're fucking dragging the show down, Already. you cocks. Oh my, oh, god damn it! <laughs> so actually, I uh, I spoke with Ming okay. yesterday. Yes. And uh, basically, I want to talk about Star Wars. Okay. We haven't talked about uh, one thing for an entire. It's the Force. Yes. Is strong with the, us. The one. Force is strong with. Okay. We're we've got a countdown going for uh, <laughs> the next Star Wars movie. There's it's a 314 lot of days. 314 days. There's a lot of hype behind it. There is. Uh, a lot of momentum. They're there bringing is. back the original cast. They have. Most of them at any rate. They have. And uh, are you telling me you're going to start lining up tomorrow? No. Is this what? No, that's not what I'm talking do about. Do I have to go to the AMC Middletown Movie Theater um, yeah. to podcast with you? For uh, that you would have to jump in your DeLorean, hit 88 miles per hour yeah. to get me on the stairs over there. So, no, you don't have to do that. Have man. you ever camped out overnight for anything? No. Never. Never. My, Mark? Oh, yeah. What Great, you camp Grateful for? Dead tickets. Grateful Dead. Yeah, okay, that's yeah. cool. Hell yeah. <laughs> A couple of times. <laughs> Uh, was this here in Jersey? Yeah, I, I camped out. Uh, as a matter of fact, one night. Was it night. December? Uh, was it December? Hey, Mark. Wow. I'm gonna just one question, please. On what fucking planet do the Grateful Dead have anything to do with Star Wars? Ming just asked me if I ever camped out. Yeah, yeah no one cares out. anyway. Then that's Did, fine. Just yes, I camped out for Grateful Dead tickets. Yes. See you later. End of end of story. Right outside this store, I slept because Jax used to be next door. Oh right, there was a yes. ticket master. Yeah, I slept right whatever. outside the stash. <laughs> if, if you're not going to help my story along, Mark, I'm sorry, I, well, I've fucking, slept in the stash, but I've never slept outside the stash. Oh, we met a guy yeah, who did yeah, sleep yeah, out the stash. Yeah, 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 yeah that's our, right. our buddy Kai. Kai, that's right, that's right. Yeah. God bless you. Kai. Well, I don't want to. I don't want to. You know, we'll still. I guess we'll tell this story another time. Okay. Sleeping out on the side. All right. I want to know about the story. Anyways. Okay. So you did. Dude, what the fuck? Seriously, you're sleeping outside the stash. Gum on your cheek. <sighs> for Wake for up. the dead, man. Yeah, I know. It was for dead. The dead. I'm sure you do not regret a moment of that. Not at all. No, not at all. God no. damn. No, man. Grateful Dead concerts are some of the best times that I ever had. I've Jerry been told. Garcia, did, man. Yeah. Were you high on mushrooms? Did um, you Did you drop some uh, some shrooms? Uh, multiple times. Shrooms. No, no. I meant like Acid. while you were waiting on. Oh, that night? No, 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 no. Not out here. No, I just smoked some weed and like you know. <laughs> yeah, just mellow beer, out. That's yeah, all. Man. That's all. Well, I'm afraid mellow to mention off. anything else about it, man, because I don't want uh, Michael here to yell at me about uh, okay. not staying on topic. All right. Okay. Stay on topic. Stay on topic. Stay on topic. Right. Um, so anyway, yes. Here's the thing: we watched uh, the um, A New Hope again on Saturday, and uh, there are some beautiful scenes in there. And Absolutely. they drop some some uh, things that could be phenomenal later on that just never bloom to fruition. Such an example: um, the Clone Wars. Okay. The Clone Wars. If you're gonna name something, the Clone Wars. Mm-hmm. Don't you think like it's the clones rise up and and are, you know, they're they're trying to get rights. Yeah, they're they're doing something, and you're like Clone Wars. Oh, that sounds so like clones against uh, two guys fighting against each other who right. are like looking who look exactly alike. Oh, okay. Instead of instead of an army of clones. Yeah. Why would it be? Why wouldn't it just be the um, the Empire? The the Empire rise. I see. Why wouldn't they saying. they name name it something else? Like it wouldn't. It, you they did use a clone army to so what to facilitate this war. So then why wouldn't they? Why the would they call wars. it? Um, I'm just saying. It's, it's no, a, they used a clone army that they. Well, ju- we they called created. it the Vietnam War, and it was us fighting against the North Vietnamese, but it was also the Vietnamese fighting against the Vietnamese. So what you're saying here is that it wasn't you want clones, clones fighting clones. You want no. clones versus clones. I actually I want clones versus who they're cloned against or cloned from. I thought that oh, you know okay. it wouldn't be right. just they rose up right. just like one clone. All right. Well. Okay. I see where you're going. Sure. But I mean, it just you, it conjures something so magical. You know, you're like, yeah. oh wow, the Clone Wars. Sure. Instead of oh, it was the Clone Wars because uh, it's like the the uh, black pajama wars. If we had named the <laughs> Vietnam War that. The black pajama wars. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All I'm saying is there was that majestic shot at the uh, near the end of episode three, I believe, where you see the huge clone army and you know their spaceships. That really wasn't that. Um, it wasn't ma- 
magical. No, it was episode that was two. Was but magical yeah. episode two. Oh, it was pretty. Oh, is that, uh, that's, like, that's when the uh, the Star Destroyer or what will yeah, become the Star Destroyer yes, is taking exactly. off. Exactly. Yeah. All right. Okay. I see. Looked yeah, pretty, that looked pretty bad. That was pretty. Bad. It, it, yeah, but I mean, when you're sacrificing, you know what? Here's the payoff. <laughs> and at the end of episode two, right. when we finally get around to doing yes. it, we'll have one shot that everyone will be like, "Hey, that was pretty cool." No, no, nah. that's. So they, what you're they, saying is it's you're, just you're, squandered. It's a squandered opportunity to have something really cool. And instead of, hey, these dudes made a clone army out of one dude. Right. And all the uh, stormtroopers are now clones. Okay, yeah. so you're disappointed. Yeah. Oh, I was massively disappointed when I found out that that's what the clone army. It, it was a clone army. I got gotcha. you. I got gotcha. you. I was I all was, made from one guy. Yeah. No diversity, no nothing. All made from Django, right? Django. Yeah. yeah. I was... Uh, yes, Django you know, I, 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 every... Not Django Unchained. <laughs> Not Django. Django. That would have been so much cooler. Though. Yeah. Cool. Although that... It, uh, they were all Jamie Foxx? That'd be yeah. fucking <laughs> badass. Badass, wouldn't it? Badass. Jamie Foxx. Instead of that unknown actor who yeah, played Django. Right. Whoever and he is. It, he, he looked Hispanic, but he talked like <laughs> he was from Australia. That's weird, right? They're very strange. Oof. I, uh, I kind of don't uh, have any love for any of the Star Wars movies, really, after Empire. I didn't even like Jedi when I was a kid. I did watch really? it. Really? You were like, this sucks. Yeah. Boom. I'm telling you, when I walked out of Jedi in 1983 as a seventh grader or whatever I was, I, I just thought that the Ewoks were terrible. I thought they rewrote the first movie. And I just wasn't, I, I really, really didn't have that same magic that I that I felt when I walked out of Empire. You guys didn't well, care anything Well, yeah, like absolutely. That? No, I had the same thing. I was like... I was swept up in the majesty, but upon deliberation. Right. Because they gave you what you wanted. It's like this big spectacle, and you saw all these people. Right. And you, then you're like, wait a minute. Let me go back and we'll rewatch it. So I rewatched it, and I'm like, that is a convoluted plan. Right. Entirely too convoluted, first off, for them to rescue Han. I'm like, wait a minute. That's that's – why would – why not go in with your lightsaber? Okay. And just <laughs> slice everyone up? Yeah. yeah. And so, or you're you're good enough to make your own lightsaber. Right. He makes his own lightsaber again, right? Okay. So why not make another one in case you lose one and put it, it in our two? Think, I think there's a hell of a lot of holes in, in Return There are of the huge. Jedi. <laughs> Return of the Jedi has holes you can fly a Star well, Destroyer yeah, through. It seemed like that one was just mailed in. Ming, yeah. though? Oh, I, well, first of all, I was eight years old when I saw it. I was just like, "Holy shit!" I got you. This freaking job, you know, you, you, I, you, you don't see Jabba the Hutt in the first one. You know, the real, the no, no, four, not you, in the, the real movies. episode four. You don't see Jabba the Hutt, so I'm like, no. "Who the hell is this?" Right, right. Look at how fat he is. <laughs> like freaking, he's a slug. He's yeah. a slug. <laughs> It's a big chance. And you're also, afraid of him. you're also seven years old. That's, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So. you're seeing it through the eyes. Yeah, there's a, the, the, there's a rancor. Like, Luke Skywalker's dressed all in black. Yeah. Uh, the, Don't you think he could have used his lightsaber there, though? But or It's like, hey, you know what? I it, really uh, need my lightsaber th- in this. This but is a good point. He could have gone in and just sliced everyone up. And True. <laughs> exactly. True. And done the mind <laughs> trick a few him. times. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. 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 He, he could have chopped Entirely too convoluted. So, um, <laughs> but getting back to the first one. But no fun. Right. So Actually, no, I disagree. It would have been funny if you went in and sliced everyone up. <laughs> it would have, yeah, exactly. You'd have been like, more like this, a video game. This is an R rated movie if I ever <laughs> Wait, saw well, it. Hold on, though. Isn't that anti Jedi, though, to just go in and slice people up? To I rescue guess. Your I, uh, no. No. And, and, isn't here, that, and I'm going to make a point. Isn't that a little dark sided? Yeah. I'm going to make a point. I agree. It would have been awesome. Second. I would have so been. Here's okay. the thing. Okay. So you're watching uh, the first one. Episode now, four. Okay. Episode four. Mm-hmm. Now they make a um, a Death Star. They do, yes, the most powerful weapon in, in the galaxy. The galaxy yes, correct. Yes, yes, sir. There's a reason for them to make the Death Star. To, to destroy other planets. Yes. Yes. Is it to mop up the the rebellion? I don't think so. Mm. The rebellion is like a rat the, fart in a high wind. Yeah, they don't. They, uh, rebellion presents no threat. Absolutely no threat. No, but uh, they, to maintain the, their 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 power in the galaxy, is like, hey man, we can blow up your planet. Yeah, but there's a it's larger. A, they're also doing it because they're uh, in canon. I find out later there is a larger threat looming out there which that is? the emperor has foreseen. It's uh, I I'm not quite sure of the which name. Which isn't of it. Luke Skywalker. Which is not <laughs> is neither Luke Skywalker nor Han Solo. Okay. <laughs> Has nothing to do with the Skywalker families. Now, where did you hear this, though? What did, uh, where... This was somebody wrote on one of the Star Wars pages oh, okay. that there was a, a threat. Like, 
coming like 80 years down the road mm-hmm. that these were they were going to be the first line of defense first and only line really okay because oh, okay. i mean uh the clones are dying out why yes. why don't you have more clones in the hopper. Yeah, why would they die out? Well, if you yeah, just why don't you just keep making them? Sense. Exactly. Because they weird ne- aliens. Why are they, you know, right. they paid they, enough money. They didn't kill that, or they didn't destroy that world. No. Why not have them just, you know, hey, Django, we've got your, your cells on file. Mm-hmm. Right. We're going to keep doing keep, keep, it. Yeah. Keep why making, not? Yes. Yeah, even if they did it on a slide with another organization. Right. Like, yes. you know, hey, we'll give you, you know, 50% off. Just get the rest of these uh, Shangad cl- clones out of here. You know? Exactly. You know, they're getting old. You give them a gold watch, uh, <laughs> throw them down a garbage chute. That's all you have to do, right? <laughs> Is that what that garbage chute was full of? <laughs> exactly. Like, old clones? Yes. Shitty old clones. <laughs> what an amazing smell you've discovered. Yeah. Um, yeah, <laughs> I'm stepping on a, a clone trooper. So the Death Star, then, you're saying, is for suit, not something. just for the rebellion. It's, it's actually something for else. defense, not offense. Yes, right. but defensive we've measure. got Grand Moff Tarkin who's like, I'm going to exceed everything that I've ever done. And, you know, all my powers, blah, blah, blah. And you know, Sure, you I'm blow gonna, up planets. Why not he, do it? He blows up Alderaan, which would it's perfect. It's a perfect uh, mind fuck for, oh, number yeah. one, Princess Leia. Is no longer a princess. Yeah, right, that's so. it, right? Sorry, babe, you're, yeah. you're you're a princess prin- in name only. You're a princess in nothing. Yes, exactly. Your planet is gone. Um, so you've got that, and um, they give this the task of finding the uh, the secret plans for the uh, the Death Star, right. who's fallen into Rebel hands, As. to Darth Vader. Okay. Okay. Pretty cool, Vader. You see one of the the coolest scenes ever. Is oh, when yeah. he steps out and you see Vader for the first yes. time. You're like, right. "Holy fuck! What the hell is this thing? He's breathing heavy." Exactly. Oh my god! But you now guess what? Puts him on the level of Rocky Balboa <laughs> in the first Rocky movie, where he's just like a leg breaker for the mob. Well, you know what? I never thought of it that way. Think about that, man. Right? Yeah. He's like an enforcer. He's like a he strong is. arm. That's right? it. Because yeah, Tarkin wow. is the guy. Tarkin barks at him. Yeah. Yeah. Well, and, there and, is a hierarchy in the Empire. Yeah, but yes, no but sense. Palpatine yeah. and his Palpatine's the guy, right? Yeah. Sure. And then there's Vader. Right. So is Vader he, should be his number two number man. Number two, right? Right. right yeah. But he's not. Right. No, he's not. You've got uh, you've got the, mo- ca- the moths. You got part. the moths, right? So you yeah. got Grand Moff Tarkin who says, "Enough! Wow. I Vader will not have this him. bickering." Well, and he's like, yeah. and he lets he, him go. He, he's like, he, as you wish. Well, he is a leg breaker. Uh, d- d- does Darth Vader possess the the the, the smarts to make uh, political decisions? Mm. Isn't Palpatine grooming him towards that end? <laughs> I suppose. Or is he not? See, that's where it gets kind of confusing right. to me. So here's and another thing that's that's completely squandered. Now this becomes, um, you know, a, a retrieval uh, mission right. okay. for the Empire. They've sure. got to go and grab this stuff because it's and it's not that high level. Right. Because they're like, well, we may have why one. Is, tiny. Why is there only one copy of the blueprints. Oh, there, I'm, I'm sure there are multiple co- like, or there's like, one. No, on like even when I even when I create like this podcast, right. I got ten copies in the cloud and shit. Right, 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 That's right. because there's maybe only the, one copy out there. Maybe the Empire doesn't have a Brian Johnson to fuck shit up, so you would okay. take the the initiative right. to go and make ten copies. So. Yes. He can't corrupt them all. Yeah. I don't know. Well, oh, that's don't all have, I'm saying. They don't have a cloud to store it on, maybe. Okay, <laughs> right. What they about got, Bespin? Okay. Come on. Okay, yeah. they got, Christ they, sakes. They've got ray guns and spaceships right. and snow speeders. And, they don't have anything over a certain and, megabyte uh, they can go into, <laughs> right. Yeah, they, they can go into hyperspace. They, have, they have floppy but, disks still, man, Yeah, but they still floppy disks yeah. Yeah. that they put into robots. Okay, so there's that. So now, now Vader is, is brought down to the level of a Henry Hill or... Um, Basically, he's he's or like lower. Sure. Yes. He's very low on the totem pole. Is, so you're yes. sitting there going, holy shit. Mm. But there's a structure to um, to the Empire. Right. With Palpatine at the head. OK. You've got your moths. Yes. And mm-hmm. um, you've got your regional governors because he says right in there that they've dismantled the Senate. Right. It says right there. Uh, pa- uh, the emperor. <laughs> Has dismantled the sen- Senate, and uh, all power will be given to the regional governors. Yes. Right. Right. So here you go. The rebellion 
blows up the the Death Star. Mm-hmm. Okay, the first time. Right. Kills a Grand Moff. All right, and uh, a bunch of other underlings. Right. Doesn't do any real damage to the Empire, except now. Oh, it was while a pretty big blow. Yeah, I know, but how? They've already got they're the, their most powerful weapon. Yeah, they are, yeah, but they already have one being built. So their their uh, their plans are to build more. Correct. I would assume, but it, it has to be a but little you, shot. It has to be a little bit of a you setback. You saw how long it the, took them yeah. to build that shit. I was going to say it has to it's be. It's not a like bit they're, of a they're manufacturing them like in an assembly line. Well, hold on a second. Uh, in theory, let me see. Nineteen seventy-seven, seventy-eight, yes. seventy-nine, eighty, eighty-one. 80. Okay. So five years to build a fucking moon. Yes. Not really that long, uh, in about, the grand scheme of things. But let's assume took about five for one years second. to build the Golden Gate Bridge. I learned so. Yeah, five years a, to build the Golden Gate mm-hmm. Gate Bridge in the 30s. All right, let's then let's assume something. I'm gonna make, and it's not even that massive a jump. Okay. While they built the Death Star, mm-hmm. they had another being built as well. So they built half the Death Star. They're building. They're building. They're building. And then they start building this other Death Star. Okay. So. I mean, you're building a moon. Let's say it takes ten years to make. Sure. Wouldn't it make sense to have concurrent moon, uh, concurrent Death Stars being built? Built at the same time. I <laughs> yes. understand. So what you're saying is that the one that we see in Jedi is already being built when we when yes. we see the first one. In, right. In, okay, got it. Got and it. it's three quarters built. Right. But it's functional. It is. Right. Fully functional Death Star. Okay. Even though it's only three quarters built. Right. And they would have these in separate parts of the galaxy. Wouldn't you? They, yeah, I would, but sure. I think I mean, for because a matter of convenience. Let's say, like, I got to borrow some of your tools, like your power tools and stuff. I'd want the Death Star a little closer. If I was like, hey, you know what? I don't have my Makita drill. Let's but, go to the other Death Star. No, nah, but here's the thing. You're depleting the resources of multiple worlds to build this fucking oh, thing, right? Oh, okay. So you that. So you got to have places that you can get the... The, the raw ore. Sure, the, the to, material. To the material. Yes. <laughs> yes. yes. Or. And so, you know what? You've got those space shuttles. They can shuttle, like the sh- the, the shuttle Tiderian. That's right. Can uh, shuttle over the Makita drill. All hey, right. we need about uh, 400 Makita drills. Right. Send them on over. Right. Oh, the sh- I got you. All so, right. yeah, yeah. All right, so. hold on. You're watching episode four. Were you seriously debating the politics of Star Wars? It certainly sounds that way, doesn't Fuck it, man? Yeah. <laughs> okay, do you know what ruined episode one? Yes. Well, hold Bullshit. on a second. Yeah, right, exactly. Of course it did. <laughs> Bullshit politics to the Gungans and shit. But, <laughs> but to be honest with you, I'm using this for the the good of saying, the Star Wars franchise. Saying, all I want to do is see shit blow up yeah. and, and exactly. start chopping people at my people point. Chopped in it, like arms being chopped off. My point. Episode exactly. four. That's what they give you. Oh. Episode one. They did not give you that, and that's why it sucked. Oh, man, I'm just I saying. Love it. I but love episode it. four, if you, uh, you know what. You're absolutely right. Okay. When you bring that shit in front of the camera, right. when you do it behind the camera, okay. and you got this stuff all figured out, right. yeah, ahead of time, yeah, mm-hmm. so much the better that you don't have to say shit like uh, in trade federation. Yeah, there's there's what there's a, a trade embargo. Of, what a load of crap! Exactly, there's a trade embargo. Are you fucking? Uh, did you ever play uh, any of the? Uh, I had PlayStation. We were playing. Okay. Uh, the Phantom Menace. Yes. Oh, fucking sucked. I played it, yeah. It was, uh, I'm like, oh my God. No, you know what's better than all those PlayStation games was the Atari um, Star Wars games. Don't yeah, know if you were playing Of course they were. Those, I did, absolutely. Uh, there was a Return of the Jedi one. There was, oh, there was an Empire Strikes Back one where you fought at at Yes. You were Snow Speeder. I did, uh, yes. Awesome. yes. There was yes. Absolutely yes. awesome. Actually, all three of them, and you were on the uh, the land speed, not the land speeder, the, uh, yeah, the speeder the, bike. The speeder yeah. bike, yeah. Right. Yes. The the, uh, the Empire Strikes Back one was, uh, was for the great. time that came oh, out when great. Frogger came out. And yeah. You would be able to reverse the snow speed or yeah. Certain, yeah, that yeah, was yeah, a lot yeah, of fun. Yeah, 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 yeah. However, the Super Nintendo, not the Super Nintendo, maybe it was the Nintendo. You would know, Ming. One of them came out with uh, three games: one for Star Wars, Empire, and Jedi. Yeah. And they actually started well, like the Empire one started on Hoth. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. That was a, that, that was an Atari then. That was, that was no, no, that was a uh, Nintendo. Nintendo. Yeah, yeah. Was and those Nintendo. were actually really good. That games. was that they was a fun. great console game because okay. I used to play it up at when I was in college. So that, that it was is in our a, yeah. it was in our Rat Skiller. Yes. 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 So anyway, here's the thing. Okay. Actually, there's a, a couple of things that that uh, I wanted to uh, jump address? in on. Okay. This. Address absolutely. Like the Sith. The Sith weren't wrong. Well, the Sith. The, uh, let's talk about let's talk about the Jedi first off. Okay. Protectors you've got of the galaxy. And another failed <laughs> um, opportunity. The Jedi Knights. Um, uh, what? An, a more elegant weapon for a simple yes. time. Right. Uh, feared Knights. Sure, they're yes. kind of like the samurai or, um, you know. 
again. Little, little throwback to medieval times. Right. But the the most elite of warriors. Again, uh, yes, samurais, perfect example. Sure. And uh, you had a council. Okay. And each and every person on that council was, um, when we get to you know number one, two, and three, each and every one of them kind of a douche. Sure. <laughs> Even Yoda. Sure. A douche. Uh, he was, yes. And I'm like, and the only one who was really... Mace Windu, douche. Mace Windu was a fucking huge douche. He's like, I don't trust Anakin Skywalker. Yes. Mm. It's like, how about fuck you? He's yeah. supposed to be your brother. Right. Yeah. You're right. calling each other, you are my brother! He's right. like, fuck you! Uh, Qui-Gon Jinn, douche. Exactly. Qui-Gon, no, Qui-Gon was actually a bit of a badass. Because he was a little more rebellious. Okay, Oh, so, right. He's like, I will train this. Yes. He's like, okay. fuck you. Okay. And fuck the council. They don't like it. I'll go my own way. Okay. I like that about him. He's like, you know what? The Jedi's aren't always right. No. Sure. And the Jedi's, there's no way they were on the wrong side. Okay. Because when you think about it, there was no right side for them to be on. Yeah. Yeah. You're right. They should have been um, an elite group set apart from. The Republic or the Empire, almost which neutral, are the same thing. Yeah. Yes, right. they went where they went, and they should have been uh, basically troubleshooters. Yeah. Imagine, if you will, sort of like an old West marshal, right? And, not the not the sheriff, but yeah. yes, and a uh, an old West marshal who patrolled lands, so and a Green Lantern. Okay, go in and you you go in. If there's trouble, you mop it. Right. Up. Okay. I hear That's you. basically it. And. Given special circumstances, he can take over like the local militia. Gotcha. Correct? Sure, absolutely. Would have been very cool. That would have been really just a great way to have the Jedi. But instead, they were there. They were part of uh, a very corrupt system. A corrupt system so corrupt that it allowed Palpatine to not only be the good guy, but also the bad guy in the same same time. At the same time. Right, right, right. So it's like, all right, you mother. And the Sith, Mm -hmm. basically, they were Jedi once. Sure. And it was like just an offshoot. It was like the tea party of the oh, right. of the Jedi. Sure. You just Absolutely. opened up another big hole, though, because you know how like uh, Vader and all the other Jedis would say, you know, I sense fear or mm-hmm. I sense this yes. or I sense that. Yes. Nobody, none of the other Jedis ever sensed that Palpatine was the Sith. No, exactly. <laughs> right. Unless I mean, he was. was not... And there should have been somewhere just even one throwaway line where, you know, how much of my power I am using to conceal myself from these. Fucking yeah, there you go. Then that's, all, that's all one thing taken. you need. You're right, Mike. You're that's right. all you needed. Yeah. And um, I guess they felt it didn't need to be said. Obviously. Uh, bullshit. Right? <laughs> Everything. Are you kidding? Everything needs to be said. And, and uh, they came up with the Sith code. And I want to read it to you. OK. Uh, the code reads. Wow, you really, uh, you're piece, really oh, pissed yeah, off about oh, this. Man. Oh no, no, no! Worked I'm very, out. I'm very pissed Sith about this. Okay. Not, okay. Uh, peace is a lie. There is only passion. Anger leads to hatred. Through passion, Anger I gain strength. <laughs> Through strength, I gain power. Through power, I gain victory. Through victory, my chains are broken. The Force shall free me. That's from a video game I played. Uh, they actually, that was actually one cool. from one yeah. of the Star Wars games. Yeah. All right, the Jedi, bunch of fucking hypocrites. That's all. The, that's their entire. That's their entire credo. That's all. That's, I have to that's say? the Sith. Oh. But the Jedi were were. Um, yes, they no. were. They were complete hypocrites. Right. I you thought. cannot. You cannot have passion. You cannot. You cannot have love. Right. Can't marry and shit. Can't yeah. marry. Why not? Uh, they're. Uh, they're not monks. Uh, no. No, that's why they were no. so pissed off. I think. Maybe the right, exactly. Right. Ming, right? <laughs> I mean, think about it. If that's if a lot of can, bottled up tension. I mean, I understand. Uh, Back in the the day, knights were Wait, not allowed. Wait, hold on! To, like they weren't allowed to like. Yeah, they, they weren't, weren't allowed to. Be, no, no, they, they weren't allowed. They, were, they weren't allowed to take their fists and slam it into their hands. <laughs> <laughs> weren't allowed to do that, man. That's not what I meant, but you know what I mean. I know exactly what they you. They weren't mean. allowed to do that. They're not allowed to. They're not allowed to to get to it all. They weren't yeah. allowed to fornicate. You can, didn't what you see fuck? like in the third one why, where? Why, why, why would I be? Why, why would I be a Jedi? Then I'd rather be get the Sith. Can totally, they do it? totally kills. Yo, fuck yeah! Passion is everything. Okay, so the Sith can. The Sith get, are allowed to get down. The Jedi yeah. aren't. Well, I want. So, I want to be at the dark. I'm going to the dark side, man. And now let me. That's, I'm going to the dark side. Think about this. That's saying that sex is evil. Right. Yeah. That's wrong. That is wrong. Right. That's right. that is you know, very wrong. It's, it's extremely sex wrong. Sex is very right. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Even in the galaxy. Even far, in far a galaxy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Especially in this galaxy right here. <laughs> so there's there's absolutely no way that. Um, Anakin and uh, Padme's love would be accepted no, by the Jedi. If they not. found out about it, gone. 
You're out. And um, that, as, as a matter of fact, I think that didn't anyone notice? No, no, no. Oh, no, uh, no is was... there? Didn't anyone notice that uh, Padme <laughs> was, you know, with child, <laughs> and well, she hung out with Anakin a lot? Yeah. Nobody yeah. really. But what's the what's the? Uh, I think Ming was about to allude to it too. What's the punishment? They throw you out of the Jedi yeah, Order. Yeah, you you're turn done. Your lightsaber in. Yeah, what's the... yeah, you're done, and maybe you get to. I, I don't know. Maybe maybe Wait, they you're... stick you in Jedi what's jail. That? You got to go know. like uh, go work at that diner on Coruscant. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's it. Right. That, that's, oh, it. Oh, that's oh man, that was that, that, that messed place up was diner. Nasty. No, uh, that's yeah. fucked up. That is. I mean, you know, and I understand where Ming's coming from too. Where it's just like you had a choice of a lightsaber yes. and no, uh, no sexual encounters yeah, with women. That, man. I would be like, yeah, keep yeah. your lightsaber, man. I got exactly. my own lightsaber. I got to work yeah, on. Yeah, it. But, yeah, hey, yeah. When they, right? yeah, but man. that's why they indoctrinated you at. <laughs> At, um, <laughs> at like age three, and they told ten year old he's too fucking old. I got you. You're, oh, okay, because they want to put it. They want to plant the seed. Oh, of course. Well, no, they didn't want to plant. They didn't want, they didn't want you plant no right, seed. Right, is right, what right. it was. Oh, right. Okay. Well, so, good, good one, Mike. Um. So yeah, that's wrong. Um. No, man. Me and Mara uh, Jade, we man, we're gonna get down. Um, yeah, seriously. I mean, I, I, with that. the dark side. I would. Yeah. Okay, so the the Jedi are defending a corrupt system. Okay. I, I said that before, but it's so true. They are part of the problem, not um, you know an answer mm-hmm. to anything. It's, and you know what? Look at how easily they were taken out. Sure. Yeah. Order I mean, 66? they had one, two. Order sixty six. There were two of them left. Sure. Afterwards, that's it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They did. They did kind of have an easy time wiping them out. I know. They, yeah, and, it's, and it, it didn't anyone? Back. It's like Order sixty six, and then their emotions turned on a dime. Yeah. The only one who sensed it was <clears throat> Yoda. It was like, wait a minute, something I... fucking stinks. Yeah. Oh yeah, and then, you know. Wait, again, another this guy's problem, about to chop you know, my head off. And he's yeah. the only one that sensed it. It's like, what? What? You know? Like, why? Why did he have the? Was the only oh, one? Right. Weak Jedi. ass Jedi's. Man. Yeah, they right. right. And exactly that. <laughs> their ranks were thinned by, and you had um, the prophecy, which actually came true, that um, Anakin Skywalker bought brought um, balance, balance to the force. Yes. Uh, so he put the power in the right hands. Mm. Now Palpatine may have fucked it over, right? But the uh, the Empire actually brought peace to the galaxy. I mean, I hate yeah. to say it, but this. It, they brought peace to the galaxy, maybe through a little intimidation, right. a little bit of fear. A Not a whole hope. lot. No, hold on. Did when when you saw Tatooine, were you like, "Wow, they're all fucked up there." Wow, look uh, at yeah. everybody shitting themselves. Uh, yeah, I did when uh, freaking Aunt Beru and yeah, Uncle Owen right. were burned to we're, a crisp. We're, we're smoldering yeah. in the corner over I did, there. Actually, and, I did. That was and, 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 and another freaking thing freaking barbecue that, Jawas. Yeah, another actually, thing that pissed me off was every time you see people, sh- uh, I mean, how many times do you have to shoot somebody with a fucking laser before you get their charred corpse? Oh, right, right. Now, was that what they, was that what they were insinuating that they shot them or they light them on fire? No, I, I think they, I lit on fire. Yeah, I, they I burned always that thought they shit. lit them on fire too. Yeah, it's yeah. a freaking ant and uncle bar. It's a moisture <laughs> farm barbecue, but, yeah. man. Sure. So they just doused them with gasoline like ISIS and yeah. went no, to town on them. Yeah, I believe that it was like some yeah. kind of imperial flame. Yeah, they wanted to destroy. Wanted to destroy. Then why aren't they using this more? And we never saw any charred corpses later on. It just wasn't in the budget, Mike. They didn't I'm have that for Star Wars. Uh, or yeah. I know, but they could have had it for Empire. They could have. They could have <laughs> done it for Empire. Not that I want to see the charred corpses, and I, I'm I'm hoping that we they didn't suffer. Them. Yeah. But well, they I suffered. Mean, they did. I, I, I think they suffered. They were killed. I gotta say were. that was the uh, the uh, the one scene that stuck with me the most. You too. When yeah. when I saw it as a kid, that the, when you saw the charred right. corpses, it was yeah. like you know I was only five when it came out, and for me it was, was heavy. Like, they would never do that now. No, no, not in a kid. Well, you think not in a kid? Maybe even an no, animated I would never kids movie. Na- for um, a movie that was. Not aimed towards kids, but right. you know, halfway aimed towards kids. Yeah, yeah. They just would have shown a burning building or something. Like, yeah, oh, they're dead. That's true. That's or true. Or smoking building. Hmm. They wouldn't have showed charred corpses. Well, but I, I appreciate that George Lucas did that. All right, Me cool. Too. So anyway, here we go. Uh, the Jedi have have a code as well. I want to uh, say <laughs> this. It. Uh, Jedi are the guardians of the peace in the galaxy. Jedi use their powers to defend and protect, never to attack others. Jedi respect all life in any form. Jedi serve others rather than ruling over them for the good of the galaxy. Jedi seek to improve themselves through knowledge and training. All right, so basically they are monks. Yes. So. Um, God, it sounds so boring. I know. Uh, but later on, listen yeah. to this. The Jedi lead a coup against an elected leader. There was a force. There was a, well, there was a Just Jedi um, 
a Jedi squad sent okay. over to Palpatine, right. who he then fucking eviscerates, right. which is pretty badass right. for like a 69 year old dude. Uh, so he takes he takes him out. They were going to relieve him. They were going to arrest him. Yes. Uh, take him out of power yes. and assume control of this. The uh, Galactic yes. Senate. Again, hypocritical. Because they're not supposed to lead uh, others. Against the code that you just read? Yeah, yes. Sure, sure. So, uh, kind of dickish, right? Yeah. Absolutely. So, every one of those guys who got shish mm. deserved it. They deserved it. And okay. Mace Windu should have had those hilt, uh, those <coughs> those lightsaber hilt guards on his uh, fucking lightsaber. <coughs> or else he wouldn't have gotten his uh, hands chopped right. off. Right. Yeah. Would have worked out yeah. for him. Yeah. Might have worked out for him. That mm. might have worked out for him. But if Anakin had joined him... I think they could have taken down Palpatine. Sure. But Palpatine's the only guy who actually gave Anakin his trust. Did. Mm. Even Yoda was like, oh, you're a douchebag. Right. You are. Uh. That's a Loosely loop. translated, yeah, but yes, exactly. I get the. Uh... So everyone, even, even, even Obi-Wan, who was, you're my brother, you know, didn't give him his entire trust. No. Which they, they created their own monster. They did. I, I guess, right? So but you blame them. I blame the Jedi. The Jedi fucked over Anakin, who turned on him. Okay. Wouldn't you? They were eating themselves the whole time. Yeah, they that whole that late. whole time they're like and they're they're like inbreeding and yeah. they're forcing their, their belief system in on itself. So uh they were corrupted by their own power. Right. Mm. Okay. Now Palpatine, probably smartest motherfucker in the, the whole galaxy. Oh, obviously, right there. yes. Even if he did get his face melted off. Yeah. I mean, small price to pay. Right. And uh, him not seeing uh, Anakin turning at the end, I, I think he had a, a, a long-term plan going on. Right. I don't think that that was his end game. I think there's something else. And at the end of Return of the Jedi, and this is this is my thesis okay. for the, the whole, yes. um, my rant here, is uh, that um, basically destroying that Death Star... They did not destroy the empire. No empire. Gave them a big I mean, blow, but again, yeah. not really that big a blow because most of the stuff is compartmentalized. All the regional governors have the power. And are they still on court? Like, where is the home base for the empire at this point? I'm Let's assuming see. it's still on Coruscant. Yes. Is it right? Coruscant? Yeah, I believe so. Okay. Yes. Let's Nobody destroyed Coruscant. <laughs> no, so. that's why I asked. That's why now, I asked. Now, personally speaking, if I were the um, the Rebel Alliance, I would take over the Death Star ah, so rather than up. destroy it. How are you going to do that? Yeah. How do they you do like that? They had like five people. Who, the Rebellion? Yeah, they had like 15 people. Again. You saw that counts that, that room, that war room. Before Again, they then, then, that, then the Rebellion, really not that powerful and really not the threat that these um, Death Stars were True. created to. I'm sure there's Unless probably... you have the blueprints, which well, says where the weakness is. All that... right, but but think about this. They destroyed okay. the, the Death Star. They did. Coruscant still lives. It does. Uh, the power is no, still you take in him down, Coruscant. You take them down one small step at a time. You know, other people here is like, oh, my God, they took down the Death I Star. I don't think that's going to I'm going to join this rebellion. You got five guys. You know, it might be difficult, Ming. But, you know, the Death Star, you go in. You maybe you get a couple of phone books. You put it on the accelerator, a few right. rubber bands. You get okay. the, the directional to, to sure. direct. Sure. It might be able to be done, you know, cause with a few people. I mean, it could be like, you for, know. I'm sorry. For, I, I don't understand what you're saying. the Death Star to, to bring it to, to blow up. You the got Earth five sun. people. Well, you yeah. know what? You, you, you get those get five people too. with, uh, get them all lightsabers. Um, Stick them at the throats of the dudes who are the technicians. Um, I'm saying small steps, small, small steps. steps. Uh, even like Terminator, for example. Did they take down Skynet? No, but but John Connor, uh, you know, made it to the time portal. Small steps, like you said, to send right? back Kyle Reese. Small steps. Yeah, small but steps. but at the end, you're to believe that um, the galaxy knows peace, no. and the only thing you're doing is creating a little. Pa even even if the uh, even if Palpatine is like the grand master right. of them all. And uh, everything is going to go to shit afterwards. There are going to be guys in there jockeying for position. Okay. You know? That's true. So everyone's – the Empire is still the infrastructure that they've got. Right. They've got no plan to do anything Ooh. else. You know? And after after the war is over, there is considerable rebuilding. Sure. That's after every war. Sure. And uh, there's a lot of desolation and a lot of – there's the black marketeers. There's a whole shitload of stuff that sure. goes on. Sure, sure. 
I don't know. You know so. what? I used to really like Star Wars before we did this show. Yeah, no, man. Excellent. Excellent. That movie sucks. You just made it suck, man. Hell man. Awesome. You hey, totally make it suck. So I'm go home I hope I did that to all well, our how listeners is, um, out how there, is too. Episode 7 going to bring it back for you? Uh, it better do something really kick ass. Such as? Such I mean, as do you have any them? Uh, how, how about little reparations from the Jedi? Topless uh, Jedi reparations. Hot tub scene. That's okay. what I want. Oh, do you want to see Carrie Fisher's sixty-five uh, year old breast? <laughs> You're more than what you can. You can have my ticket, my my brother. I yeah. don't know. I mean, you know, how, how, her clone maybe or a younger clone. Yeah, now you're talking. Slave Leia clone. A couple of them. Yeah. <laughs> I think that, that ain't going to uh, happen. Nah, I know, I know. Now, do you <laughs> a think little now too that, late. Now that Disney has it, you yeah, think right. we got a shot? Yeah, no. probably not. More sanitized. Oh, man, oh, man. All right. I want to see more shit blowing up. I want to see lightsaber battles. Uh-huh. I want to see, see people some, chopped in half. You want to see some uh, some hands flying off? Yes. I want to okay. see spaceships. That's the, I, And I want to see aliens. Uh, and, it's and J.J. I see Abrams. I think you're and going good. to. That's, I don't want to see bullshit politics. I don't. I, 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 I'll tell you one thing, though. In uh, Star Trek Into Darkness. Right. Yeah. One of the coolest scenes was when they were doing the the politic thing, when they're all sitting around and they're, they're going that, yes. back and forth. Right. Yeah. And uh, then Khan comes and fucking blows up the entire. Right. Oh, yeah, 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 fucking, yeah. I'm like, this is the kind of politics I like. Right. Yeah. And there's that messed up Federation ring, ring that turns out to be a bomb and shit. Yeah. Alka Seltzer. Yeah. Yes. yes. Boom. That's pretty cool. Again, I, stuff blowing up. Yeah, yeah. More action. More, more blo- action. More stuff blowing up. Yeah, That's it. Totally. Easy. Political intrigue is what you want, man. I'll, Not just I'll, politics. I'll watch Law and Order if I want to see political intrigue. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think Law and Order that's you, is political that's your go-to. intrigue. Oh right. Um. All right. Well, I don't know. I watch. Uh. I, I watch. You J- watch The West Wing. Right. All right. Wa- right West Wing. I watch JFK. I don't know. <laughs> yes. Watch something else. I watch Star Wars. Yeah. I watch Oliver Stone movie. All right. Cool. All right. So and that's 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 basically what I have to say about Star. That's Wars. it. That's it. All right. Point taken, Mike. Thank well, you. Well, 314 days, you'll you'll find out. Oh, we we'll, will. We'll discuss this again. We'll find out together. Sure. Pretty cool. All right. Well, thank you guys for this interesting and vigorous discussion. Thanks for letting me sit in, guys. I sure do appreciate You're it. You're not sitting in all. anymore, dude. You're part of this <laughs> broadcast now, whether you like it or not. Yeah. yeah. All right. Well, we did it. Um, People I'll, love you, dude. I see We feedback. did it a little bit sooner than I thought we were going to do it, but... Welcome to the podcast. Yes. Thank you, guys. Welcome I sure to the party, pal. I appreciate it. I, uh, it means the world to me being able to do this with guys that I uh, I truly do love. Thank you so much. All right, You're shut good. the fuck up. Exactly. All right. Have a good weekend, everybody. This has been a production of Smodco Internet Radio.